guys, how are you? Uh, I hope everybody's doing okay. So guys, so I did a community post a couple of days ago. And a couple of days ba? Or maybe a week ago. Tapos guys, I asked you if you want to, you know, for me to do a car review. If you are a subscriber of mine, especially way back guys, I'm talking about 5-7 months ago, I used to do a lot of car reviews. Kasi mahilig talaga sa kotse guys. So, you know, I have friends who have cars, uh, mga taga dito rin. So, sometimes they lend me their cars to review. So, that's what I used to do, guys. Before I started doing yung parang, hindi naman daily vlogs, but vlogs about my life, about my personal life, and also doing vlogs uh, when I travel or when I eat in certain places para I can share to you guys, you know, uh, kung, you know, places na, maybe hindi nyo pa napuntaan, di ba? So, it would be nice to share information to you guys, di ba? Kasi this channel of mine, guys, it's just about, you know, spreading positivity, good vibes, at the same time, information in my perspective, di ba? So, yun. So, today, guys, I'm gonna show you uh, comparison. I guess it's a comparison of what BMWs before, 20 years ago, and what BMWs are now. So I have a BMW X1 dito. I'm right actually I'm sitting inside of it right now. And I'm gonna show you, of course, my personal car, which is a E46 330i converted siya. So from a 318 naging 330i na siya. So I'm gonna show you the the especially how it looks. Because guys, yung mga BMW na yun, sobrang laki ng kidney grill niya. Sobrang you know, it's really big compared to the old ones. Especially if you compare them to the really old BMWs from the 70s and the 80s, diba? Mga E30s, mga E34, diba? So, compare natin. I'm gonna show you. If you look at my car, diba? The grill is not that big. I mean, it's proportion to the headlights, diba? So, guys, this one, if you watch my review, if you haven't, please watch it. Ito yung 2001 ko na E46. 318 shop I before, guys. Non-facelift. So, ngayon, facelift na siya. Way bigger engine. So, it's a 330i engine. So, it's a 6-cylinder na siya, guys. From a 4-cylinder converted. The reason why I did it, guys, because, like I said before, I will never sell this car. So, it just makes sense for me to upgrade it. Para mukhang bago ulit. It runs better. Way better now. Quieter. See the grill, the M Sport grill. M Sport rims there. So, it's... Sapphire. So guys, if you look at the 20 year old BMW, so 21 years actually. Oh yeah, 20, 2001 kasi to guys. Diba? And look at the modern BMWs. So this is a BMW X1. And look at the grill. Tignan mo naman yung grill guys. Compared to, diba? It's way smaller. Though this is a sedan, and this is like a crossover. So this is an X1. This is a X120D, so D stands for diesel. So, tignan mo, how big. Tapos, guys, yeah, no? you can see, when you go through it, you can see the ra the radiator, the condenser, ah, the, yeah, the condenser and the radiator, di ba? Tapos, the lights, guys, ito, naka parang angel eyes, pero a little bit modern na. So, it's not ring. So, may pagka may may konting straight siya sa baba. So, yan, LED lights na siya. Okay, with this one naman, projector, pero HID siya. I didn't put rings, guys, because masyado malaki yung projectors ko. So, yun. So, yun. If you look, so this is like a crossover. So, a lot of modern BMWs, but we have the X1, and we have an X2. An X2 is kind of like the X1, but a little bit more sportier in terms of look. And I think the X2 is even smaller. Tapos yan, guys. So, tomorrow or Saturday, I have to replace the tires kasi sobrang put-put na. So, the modern BMWs, guys, ano yan eh, run flat. So, really expensive to replace. So, a lot of first-time owners, what they do, pag, you know, pag medyo worn out na tires, they, they replace them with normal tires because they're way cheaper at the same time, more comfortable to ride in. I think run flat tires are too expensive. So the, these guys, these rims are twi uh, 18 inch rims. 22550 are uh, R18. So ito guys, 17 inch. Of course, being a crossover, 
medyo mas thicker yung tires nito. So, 18. So, guys, ito, 20D. The, the meaning of 20 is a two point, basically a two liter, four cylinder diesel. D stands for this diesel. X drive is parang their four by four. Yan ang ibig sabihin ng X drive. When it comes to BMW terms. So, yan, guys. X1. Really nice car. It drives like a sedan because it's the same size. Just a little bit higher. You have ground clearance. Diba? But it's so easy. Though it's a diesel, medyo maingay sa labas. But once you're inside the car, tahimik naman siya. It's actually very, very comfortable. So, a lot of girls, they love these kind of cars. Kasi, you know, medyo maganda yung ground clearance. At the same time, diba? it's diesel, so matipid. At the same time, madali park So, yun. So, ito guys, the color... Parang siyang bluish gray yun yung yung color niya. I don't know exact name of the the color. So LED tail lamps na siya. Tapos it's power tailgate. So yon. So parang siyang you know like any SUV parang siyang hatchback. So you have a power outlet here. Yeah, there's some power outlet. Yeah, so you could charge at the back. Tapos you could fold the seats by Pushing this button right there. Yeah. Also, or here. So, 60-40 split siya, guys. So, yeah. Meron din dito. Then, you know. Then, it even has a camera. Silicon. So, if may accident, at least may record niya. So, yun. You could just close it by pressing this. So, close mo. Yan. Sarado na siya. Yan. Then, it has, the cool thing, it has twin, you know, twin exhaust do and it's real exhaust hindi siya yung parang display lang and to think it's a diesel so that's pretty cool tapos it has your sensors then you got your backup camera here so medyo madume i apologize so at the back guys just like even the 20 uh 20 year old BMWs ganito parang may pag gloss black trim siya plastic so yun tapos leather dito so, fully automatic on all four windows. Tapos, the leather seats are really nice. As you can see. Tapos, may mood lighting yan. Yan. Pag gabi, guys, yan. It's either red siya or white. So, pag gabi, it's really nice. It really looks, you know, very modern BMW. Tapos, yan yung front. Later, I'm gonna go at the front and I'm gonna show you what, you know, the features of this BMW X120D. Tapos, yun, guys. May... Aircon vents and a charging 12 volt. Sa baba. Sige. Punta tayo sa wrap. So guys, kakapalit lang ng battery actually ng unit na to. So, this is a AGM battery. Meaning, this is for cars that have start-stop. Pag nakita mo start-stop. Kasi modern cars guys, puro halos start-stop na yung technology. Meaning, ibig sabihin nun, Kapag nag-stop ka, tapos medyo matagal yung stop, let's say you're in the highway, medyo matagal, it will actually shut off the engine, pero nakon yung aircon mo. So, the, the reason for that is to save on fuel. But, the only problem with that, because it's always traffic dito, di ba, medyo traffic dito, so, lagging, you know, nag-off yung engine, di ba? So, yung iba, they just switch off the... There's an off button, guys. Papakita ko sa inyo mamaya. Now, you could switch off the uh, start-stop, which is good. Kasi mahal ang battery, guys. This battery is 21,000. Just for this battery. Normal batteries would cost eight to 9,000. And this one's way more than double. Yun lang ang uh, bad thing about it. So, pasok tayo, guys. Let's check the interior of this X1. So, maganda. You got your memory seating dito. So, one and two driver. Then, you could set it. Then, you got your lumbar support. Tapos dito, your electronic. I think both seats, guys, at the front are. So, tingnan natin. Tapos ito, guys, yung key. A very modern BMW key. Very typical of every BM. Okay, start natin. Kasi medyo mainit, guys, ha? Labas. So, start. So, this is push start. Press the brake, then start. Yan. And it has a really nice chime. Uh, natin yung aircon. So, dual zone climate control siya, guys. 
Tapos, you got your radio. So, very traditional. Even the older BMWs, guys, ganito yung setup. Halos same. Of course, this one has, like, white lighting. Ang mga older BMWs, parang amber. Diba? Tapos yun, yung radio. Which is nice, you still have physical buttons. Kasi, a lot of the modern cars now, puro touchscreen. The problem with that, pagtagal, baka masira, and you cannot physically on your aircon or your radio. Tapos, guys, ito yung MMI system nila. So, you control it here. Dito. So, knob type siya. Diba? Tapos, may menu. You go media. Then, you got your back option. Electronic parking brake. So, pag press mo ng brake, you press it. Magdi-disengage. Mawawala yung red light. It's like a normal handbrake, pero a smaller version. When you lift it up, mag-red siya ulit. Yeah. Then, you got your hill descent control. Parking sensors front and back. You got your sport, normal, or eco to save on diesel fuel. Diba? Traction control off dito. So this one is a 8-speed, I believe a ZF. So that's what they use, BMW. ZF, automatic transmission. Wala siyang paddle shifters, but you could do plus minus here. Up and down, ganun. So let's put it at reverse just to see the rear view camera. So, yun yung rear view camera, guys. May sensor sa likod to make sure that you're near na. So, magiging red siya kung super lapit ka. Tapos, meron din sa front. So, lagay muna natin sa park. Okay. Tapos, of course, your hazard. Diba? Guys, so this is a 2018 model. And it only has 14,000 kasi ginagamit lang normally, I think. I would believe to pick up the kids. Uh, you know, that's about it dito lang, around the area, so ang baba ng mileage niya for a 3-year-old car so 2018 kasi ito eh, so 3-year-old car so yun guys so diesel fuel, nakalagay naman diesel para hindi kayo magkakamali if you do go to the gas station especially for people who are not really into cars but guys, you would know if it's diesel kasi medyo maingay ng konti ang diesel eh, compared to gas, right? then you got your automatic headlights dito, fog lights front rear fog lights Tapos adjustment sa interior lights dito. So, yan. So, maganda automatic guys. Para pag gabi, mag-on siya magkusa, di ba? You don't have to on it anymore. Then you got your lock and unlock button here. And then your mood lighting all the way here. Your, of course, like any other car, window switches, side mirror controls. And dito naman yung trunk, pwede may lift rim. So, yeah. The steering wheel is really nice. Reminds you of like the 1 Series. It's it's kind of a small steering wheel. But it's very easy to drive. Super easy. Tapos yun, you got your phone calls here. You could answer your calls. A voice call then. Tapos volume for your stereo. You know. Tapos yun, may mood lighting ka pa dito guys. You know, kita mo. It's nice. Especially at night. Super ganda. Then you got your glove compartment na may ilaw then you have your manual here yeah. it's a nice X1 for the price I think I think brand new guys this was around 3.3 million Philippine pesos but second hand I think you get it for like 2.3 to 2 million for for ganitong year or even now 2017 so not bad so guys this is the interior light so may you know like older BMs ganito parang amber yung color niya yeah, so tingnan natin yung front guys. So this is the back. So yung LED lights niya, super nice especially at night. So very modern, ba? Super clean. But all, you know, all the newer cars ganito na yung mga ilaw guys, sa pro LED. So even the front, you know. So LED ring siya, DRLs. So you got your daytime running lights, then you got your LED headlights there. Tapos let's open the hood. And I'll show you. There you go. So this is a 2 liter 4 cylinder diesel twin power turbo from BMW. So medyo tight siya, tight, you know, sakto lang. There's a lot of covers here. Tapos guys, dito yung battery where they replace. Ang daming covers kailangan tanggalin. Because nakatago yung battery. So you got your plus here. So if you're gonna charge it or something, ganyan na siya. And you got your brake, brake fluid. 
Everything's here. But I think this is electronic power steering, so wala siyang power steering fluid anymore. Then you got your washer fluid dito. So yan guys, yun yung front with that big grill compared to the smaller one, di ba? The older BMWs. Tapos the, the hood guys is so light. Super light siya. Di ba? Tapos you got your hood shocks of course. Like all modern cars. So okay naman siya guys, super tipid. 13.3 kilometers per liter, upper, uh, 13.3, yeah, kilometers per liter, uh, on the last reading, so, not bad, guys, that's city driving, huh, so that's not bad at all, to think this is a crossover, so close that then. Okay guys, let's drive around. Seatbelt muna. A good excuse for me to get out of the house and use the aircon, di ba? So let's go. Yeah. So the monitor will shut off in a bit. Yeah. So labas muna tayo. See? Super sunny guys. It's around, what time? Almost 3 p.m. Yung kalaban ng BM, oh. Audi. <laughs> Our Audis are really nice cars, guys. They're not as common dito sa Philippines, but then you got a Mazda CX-5 dito, the new one. Also a nice crossover. Then you got a Lexus IS350 dito. Nakapark lang sa labas. Sayang naman. Diba? I just want to let you know, if you do visit the village, please follow the rules. Meaning, pag full stop, full stop talaga. Yeah, in front of us, we got the ever-famous Ford Everest, di ba? Pinakasikat na seven-seater and dito sa Pilipinas. Everybody loves their diesel SUVs. I get it uh, because it's very torquey. At the same time, murang diesel guys dito. I think in here, Manila, parang nine pesos difference uh, compared to gas per liter. So really cheap, di ba? Yan, guys. So we're just driving along. Driving this beautiful car, BMW X1. Sarapi drive. In the States, guys, or in other parts of the world, especially in the States, they only sell this sa, uh, at uh, a gas variant siya. Hindi siya diesel. Kasi hindi siya... Diesel cars in the States are not that, um, uh, you know, popular. Just because mas mahal bilhin ang diesel. And I think their fuel is even more expensive than gas. Hindi ka guys sa Pilipinas, it's the opposite, di ba? So, I think they have a X128i X-Drive. Tapos, I think, yeah. Or maybe even a 40i. I'm not sure. But yun yung variant dyan. Yun guys, it's do a short test drive lang. You know? Super small. Parang nag-drive ka actually na parang hatchback na kotse. So, now I'm in a full stop. And nakapatay yung kotse, pero naka on yung aircon. So that's the start-stop function. You could actually off it if you press this button. But of course, this is a new battery, so I tested it out. So if I release the brake, guys, tignan mo ah, kasi mag-go na tayo. Ayan, nagsa-start na siya. So that's good. At least we know that the battery works. Diba? The AC Delco. Uh, AGM battery, so for the deep cycle battery siya. So yun guys, so basically that's the feature of the X1, so in a lot of modern cars, ibig sabihin on, it basically saves on fuel. So, pretty good. Pag traffic guys, yun. Pag medyo matagal yung stop. Pero maganda, naka-on pa aircon, which is good. Uh, just a simple um, review of this beautiful car. 
So this 2018 BMW X1 uh, 20D. So this is the two liter four cylinder diesel, turbo diesel siya. Uh, so I hope you like the review. Uh, haven't done these kind of reviews in quite some time. Uh, I know a lot of you guys also like me doing these kind of uh, reviews. So very simple lang, not too technical because ako to be honest guys, I also don't like yung super technical reviews. Gusto ko yung something ano, straight to the point lang na, uh, you know, like, kasi most people also, they're not too, um, how do you call it? Uh, they don't understand certain things in cars. So I like to explain it in a simple way para maintindihan nyo yung kotse, di ba? So, you know, like di it being a diesel, matipid siya sa diesel, uh, tapos maintenance cost rin ng mga kotse. So guys, feel free to ask me anything about cars or whatever. Uh, I really do appreciate you guys following me. Uh, our channel is growing and I'm I'm very happy and I'm, I'm very thankful. So guys, yun. So this is the 2018 BMW, uh, BMW X1. You guys take care. Pauwi na ako. Uh, just enjoying a little, uh, you know, road. Hindi naman road trip. Ano ba tawag dito? Ronda, ronda lang. Pa, paikot lang tayo, di ba? But sometimes when you're bored, di ba guys? You just want to drive around. So guys, take care. God bless. And I'll see you soon. Music